Nebo TV here. I spit my lyrics like a Operation Cobra. My style ain't magic and I hate Obia. Hit you like a bolt of lightning. Hunter tells a bolt you make me frightening. When I'm on the mic, young chats be shocking. Real life where I get the people brocking. See me on the stage, I know there be no mocking. Says I come to get you walking. I said I wanna see the people from the street. You jump up and move your feet to the sound of Irish man's beats. Listen, Irish man, style unique. Like a little tweety, but I said I sing sweet tweet. Yeah. Spirits in high places. I've noticed a worry in Trent. Every a lot of the bookshops are going to have the Bible, the Holy Bible down in the basement. That's not the place for the Holy Bible. Up above all the other books is the place for the Holy Bible. The battle is with the spirits in high places and principalities, not against the flesh. We battle against spirits. Spirits battle to devour our flesh and corrupt our flesh and turn it into toxins. Microbials. So after World War II, after the Spanish influenza, the epidemic, the plague God sent to wipe us out after engaging in terrible warfare, the lefty government decided to pull a fast one and give the people that were left over from the war a couple of houses here and there. But then they went, that's when they, they got everyone into, lulled them into a full, full sense of security. Then they brought everyone, then they started to build tenements. One on top of the other, one on top of the other, then anyone came tower blocks. And in them tower blocks were people from abroad who didn't worship the, who don't worship the Christian God. They worship stuff like Kali, Shiva, a multitude of deities, the dead. But what that's their own business. But they're above the Christians. And that's where you that's where we're making the mistake. I found a pagan temple um across from St. Michael's Church in Oxford. The Saxon Tower, just up from the Saxon Tower, right across from the, mon the, mon the monument above everyone's head, and the Kali, the deity. It looks like, if you look at it, you could see it as some sort of a, um, a noro or a virus with a little nucleus in the middle and a little and, and it runs around. It looks like a virus that he made a statue of it and idol and prayed to it because they look into the darkness, into the microbial world. I was supposed to look into the Bible, into the light, the way, the truth, and the light. The further we look in there, something will jump out of the darkness of the abyss and devour us all. If those days were not short, but for the elect few, there would be no flesh left upon the earth. So, building all these tenement houses and blocks of flats on top of one another, you had to have Christians on the top of them to battle the spirits. It doesn't make a difference to the, to the heathen where you put them, top, middle, or bottom. They're happy. But it makes a difference to a Christian. Because a Christian is supposed to battle the spirits in high places, the Lord of the air with the Christian Bible above as high up as they can get. That's why prophets go to mountains. That's why the, the Queen builds a castle on top of her house. That's why on a mountain, that's why on a hill, and God says, I will establish you high on a rock above your enemies. The rock and the high tower have salt in you, some million prophesies from a pillar of salt. You're getting all this. Does it go into your heads? So I see a pattern of people. It's not a coincidence because if I go into the bookshop, so I see all the all the Bible down in the basement. Someone's orchestrated that. It would be a coincidence if it was just one place, but it's not. It's low. It's all, and it's in every town. So there's a system here. There's a system that we don't see at the moment. Some of us see it because our eyes are open and our ears. Anyway, have a lovely day. Today is the Sabbath. Shabbat Shalom. God bless. And lovely, long live the Queen <laughs> and all things ancient epic in Galatia or foolish Galatians.